what's up family really quick i want to share this because i know that somebody else would benefit from hearing this this is for me but i know that you will benefit from hearing it too so um what if i told you that that thing that god took away that relationship that god took away um the the business that he allowed to fail the whatever it is the idea that you had you tried to go through with it and it didn't go through what if i told you that he took it away so that you would appreciate him more what if i told you he took it away so that you would seek his face more what if i told you that he took it away so that the person that was in your life that you were entertaining that he told you to let go of couldn't block your blessing what if he took it away to protect you y'all i've been in a season of purging and that is of relationships, of the inner things that need to come out, of things, just bad habits, everything. I've had to give up people that I love, relationships that I thought would last forever. Um, I had to give up a lot of things. And what God is showing me that because I was willing to give it up, because I was willing to let it go, because I was willing to seek God concerning it, he is blessing and returning to me way more than what I was afraid of giving up, way more than the things that I wanted to hold on to. So if that's you in this season and you feel like you're going through a purging or you're trying to ask God, why did you take it away? Why did you remove this person from my life? I love this person. Why did you, why did you take them away from me, God? I'm here to tell you that there is something that God wants to do for you that is bigger and greater, but it's going to require your obedience. So if he said, let that person go, let them go. If he said, stop with the business, stop that business because he will return to you with something that is bigger and better. And he'll make sure the right people are around you at the right time. Okay. So I just wanted to share that God has been increasing me internally, physically, um, and influence. He's just been increasing me. And that was by way of obedience, being willing to let people go, being willing to let things go, being willing to let ideas go so that God can take it, transform it, and put it into works by his doing, by his wisdom, by his knowledge. Okay. So I love y'all. I pray that you receive that and just don't, don't be afraid to let it go. Let it go. I know people say, let it go and let God, but no, for real, let it go and let God do what he wants to do concerning your business, your life, and your relationships, okay? Love you. Peace.